Hey everyone, Barry here with Geek Out Studio, and we're continuing looking at uh, different ways to uh, paint, reinforce, and coat uh, foam for props and armor. Uh, switching things up today, I'm uh, switching to insulation foam. And what I did today was I just cut out a, a small piece of half inch uh, insulation foam and sprayed on a couple of coats of Plasti Dip. And the nice thing is you can probably see is that the Plasti Dip doesn't eat the uh, foam. So you can pretty much cut, uh, cut your prop, uh, sand it and everything and then uh, spray on the Plasti Dip and as you can see from the uh, the surface, you get a very nice, smooth, uh, soft surface. So you could uh, theoretically use this as like a primer, uh, primer slash sealer or uh, uh, sealer slash uh, base coat, and then you know spray other co uh, other colors on top of this without uh, without eating the foam. So. Uh, as far as reinforcing, as you probably know, you know, insulation foam is uh, pretty uh, rigid as is. Uh, generally, what I do with my props is what uh, I'll actually sandwich uh, an eighth-inch piece of uh, hardboard between uh, basically two pieces of insulation foam, just to kind of uh, add add a little bit of uh, rigidity to it, but. I do have uh, two uh, two more pieces of insulation foam that I've coated with uh, wood glue uh, and PVA, uh, just to kind of get get them prepped for some of the other methods uh, for painting and uh, sealing and things like that. But like I said, uh, this is uh, this is just a couple of coats of Plasti Dip. Uh, be sure to uh, like and subscribe so uh, you'll get updated when uh, the new videos uh, come out. And as always, if you have any questions or comments, leave them in the comments section. And I will uh, see you all next time.